Hey y'all, it's Betsy with Happily Ever After, etc. And welcome back to another garden video. So today I have one, two bushes to plant. Not anything super exciting, but I picked these up last week. My local garden center had a um, kind of a clearance sale. It's kind of the end of our season. It's really, really hot heading into August. It's been hot all of July. A lot of things in the garden are suffering. They will hopefully start coming back towards the end of August as the temperatures get less hot. But since the garden center was having a really big sale, I mean, it went down and I ended up getting two of these bushes for $6, which I thought was great. So they are a snow bush, snow on the mountain. There was very little info on these on the tag. I Googled them and they said that they do work in my zone. I'll try to put the zones they work in on screens. All I remember is they worked in my zone. Um, they can grow five feet tall by three to four feet wide. And they have this really pretty white and pink kind of habit that the new growth comes out in. So I just thought they were really pretty. And I've been looking for some bushes, uh, shrubs, plants, things that are lower maintenance, but still interesting to kind of go around my air conditioner a little bit and hide portions of that area. So since these can take full sun, they get quite big, but they're still pretty. I thought they'd be a great option over there because it is a very full sun spot. Um, just to give us a big backdrop, I got two of them. They'll grow up, they'll be pretty, and I can always either put smaller cone flowers or perennial flowers or shrubs in front of them or they're interesting enough that if they get big enough quick enough i can just leave them up by themselves they make a very pretty screen so we're going to go ahead and pop over there and plant them today this is not a very long-winded excited multi-planting kind of thing it's more of a spotlight if you've ever grown these let me know because i've never heard of them before let alone grown them butterfly likes this bush um so i'm excited to try them i am hopeful that it says everything that i've read everybody at my garden center says they'll do okay in our full alabama heat but um it's hot down here y'all so i have been waiting i have them over here part of my drip i have two of these little stakes over here that are water so whenever I get new bushes or plants that I'm not ready to plant yet, I just pop them over here with the water stakes in them. They get water twice a day like everything else until I'm ready to plant them. Um, and it has just been, it's been a hundred and whatever every day for the last couple weeks. So I've kept them in the shade with water. It is supposed to rain every day this week. So I am going to get them in the ground before it rains. And hopefully if I can get them in the ground, before it rains and it rains all week, they have a good, they have a really good chance of surviving and thriving and looking great for us. So let's go ahead, take them around and we're gonna, I'm gonna decide, I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna plant them side by side or kind of kitty corner. Like I said, I've got a spot kind of around the air conditioner where I wanna start layering some things. So take them over there and see what we think. I think there's weeds. All right, let's go. All right, I think I'm gonna go with this and then I can put more things in front if I like. 
I'm gonna be moving the pea gravel out of this area, so I'm not gonna worry about that today. I'm just gonna go ahead, dig, and get these in the ground. Because the thunder and lightning is starting, and I'm hoping that means the rain is not far behind. All right, 
two bushes, got them planted. I do think they're a little closer than I'd like, but I don't want to get too close to the air conditioner while still filling in this spot. So if they both survive and they get too big, we may try to transplant one. If not, we'll just let them grow. We will see y'all in the next video. I'm going to go in before it starts raining. Bye.